Hello students. In this video, we will be studying about third agricultural practice that is adding manure and fertilizers to the crop field. So here in these pictures you are seeing manure which is organic substance and which is natural. On the other hand you are seeing fertilizer which is inorganic artificial synthetic manure is less rich in plant nutrients whereas fertilizer is rich in plant nutrients application of manure and fertilizer to the crop fields crops require certain nutrients so generally plants require nitrogen, phosphorus and potassium for healthy growth and these are supplied by adding manure and fertilizer to the crop plants. Repeated cultivation removes soil nutrients and soil becomes a deficit of important nutrients. These nutrients can be replenished by the application of manure and chemical fertilizers. So here in the picture you are seeing that person is spraying fertilizers manually. On the second picture it is being sprayed by tractor. Now in this slide we will be studying about difference between manure and fertilizer. So manure is organic substance. On the other hand, fertilizer is an inorganic substance. Manure is prepared from vegetable and animal waste. On the other hand, fertilizers are made from chemicals. Manure can be prepared at home. On the other hand, fertilizers are prepared at factories. Manure is less rich in nutrients, whereas fertilizer is nutrient specific and very rich in nutrients like nitrogen, potassium, phosphorus. Manure shows slow result. On the other hand, fertilizers show quick result. Manure do not harm the soil, whereas fertilizers change the soil texture. So in this way, manure is more beneficial than fertilizers. Manure is dilute whereas fertilizers, they come in packets, they are concentrated and compact. Now what are the advantages of fertilizers? First, it dissolves fast in the water. Secondly, plants can absorb dissolved fertilizers quickly and they give fast result. Fertilizers are nutrient specific that is the soil uh, needs a what kind of fertilizer that can be easily supplied through Fertilizer, for example, if so soil is nitrogen deficient, then we can easily supply nitrate fertilizer to the soil. Fertilizers are compact and concentrated. They come in packets. Some examples of fertilizers are urea and PK. Now, there are some disadvantages of using fertilizers. First, it pollutes the soil and water bodies causing eutrophication that is oxygen level of water decreases resulting in the death of aquatic organisms. So it causes soil and water pollution. Next, it changes the soil chemistry. It makes the soil either acidic or basic. It kills the soil organisms. 
it reduces soil porosity and it enters into the food chain and gets accumulated in different organisms of the food chain and finally it comes to human beings so these chemicals they affect the human health on the other hand manure not having any disadvantages it is having all the advantages so what are the advantages of manure it enhances the water holding capacity of the soil as soil becomes porous it improves the texture of the soil it promotes the growth of friendly microorganisms it increases the aeration and percolation of water because soil becomes porous in nature so more air more water can be accommodated in it So there are different ways by which soil can be replenished with nutrients. So various practices used to replenish soil nutrients are first one is field fallow that is we can leave the land fallow blank empty for a season or for a year and residues of previous crops decompose and they make the soil nutrient rich another practice is crop rotation that is at one time we can sow leguminous plant another time we can sow non leguminous plant so in this way nitrogen content of the soil is balanced third one is multiple cropping that is in the same field we can grow two or more types of crops having different nutrient requirements so in this way yield of the crops will be good and soil doesn't become deficit in different nutrients and another practice is by adding manure and fertilizers to the crop field Okay students so in this video we have studied about addition of manure and fertilizers to the crop field replenishment of soil nutrients and basic difference between manure and fertilizers and also advantages disadvantages of manure and fertilizers so In the next video we will be studying about next agricultural practice that is irrigation till then take care bye bye have a nice day thank you